Chris Richman is hard at work. He's learning new skills and using tools he's never used before. The only thing that I've used in the past is a drill press, and everything else is pretty new. Chris is drilling, grinding, and bending metal to build bike racks through a training program called Metro Metalworks, developed by Lutheran Metropolitan Ministries. We're a faith-based agency serving all people in the community who are uh, forgotten and hurting in society. We particularly work with people who are homeless, um, people who are involved in the criminal justice system, older youth who are at risk, and um, people with disabilities. The program provides jobs for up to five men at a time. In addition to being a viable business, uh, it, it provides work experience and training to individuals that we serve from across LMM, whether it be reentry individuals, at-risk teens, or individuals who find themselves homeless. Uh, and they learn skills from pipe bending, welding, to the basic construction and installation of the bike racks. The idea is to create a profitable business, offer locally produced bike racks, and provide jobs for residents here to help them get their lives back on track. They plan to sell up to 300 bike racks this year. Uh, selling bike racks to the general public. Uh, some of our customers have been the Cleveland Clinic uh, and McDonald's. Uh, so it's actually uh, really been taking off. We've been surprised by the interest. Uh, and we're going to continue to sell them all this summer and into continuing years. I'd say if you're interested in purchasing a locally made bike rack that is theft resistant of high quality uh, and helps benefit the community, you can go to our website at www.lutheranmetro.org and we can actually help install it so that you don't have to go through the, uh, the paperwork and help you make sure that you're in compliance with city local rules and regulations and make it very easy for the customer. The work here is dirty and noisy, but it's a job. And with it comes the satisfaction Chris feels when he sees his bike racks around town. The other day I was traveling out to one of the McDonald's that we had talked about or that we had installed and just being able to see that it's, well, one still there and two people are using it make it really exciting actually. Because you can point to it and say, I had a piece of that, or I was part of that, I enjoyed that. Chris is still not sure what lies ahead, but he knows this experience is going to help him get there. My ultimate goal isn't necessarily to be a manufacturer, but once again, it's helping me go get to that point. Chris has been at the shelter for about a year. His job here at Metro Metalworks has not only given him new skills, but a paycheck. And that paycheck could be the turning point for Chris any time now. I'm looking to be on my own or in my own apartment within the next three months. For News Channel 5, this is Brian Archer.